Hello, you guys. Hello, hello. Good to see you. I I don't know. I was bored and I had like a few hours. I thought we could just hang out, chit chat. I see Queen Cobra is live. I think he was telling me she's been live 24 hours now, <laughs> which is wild. I don't know how she does it. I'm tired after two hours, but um, hey, Eric. Hello, Tia. Hello, Hyde. Hello, Hugh. Beatrix, Poppy, Canny. Good to see you. Snugglepuss. Hello. All right. So Twitter has been pretty damn entertaining. It has been. Do you guys want to go there first? And then we can go watch Nell complain for a little bit. Also, Aaron sent me some videos um, for those who are new to, I, I call her Nell because I knew her as naked and laughing. So like she'll forever be that person to me. Um, in case you're like new to everything, Aaron sent me a couple of videos um, on a background and it tells you about her like love triangle. And then I think there was another video that would just came out today at some point um, about King Cobra's eviction. So more info about that. Um, 24 hours. Yeah. So when we stopped watching her last night, I think she had fallen asleep. But then um, I guess she woke up and she's still streaming. She's still going. <laughs> she's still going. Hello, Soil. Good to see you. Twitter is always fun. All right. Let's go check out Twitter for a few minutes and then we can go watch now complain about everything. Complain about complaining, pretty much. Let's see. There's a lot of specul. Well, there's actually not a lot. Okay, there's like mixed feelings on Twitter because I've been snooping around and looking at what people are saying about foodie beauty. And for the most part, it seems like <laughs> everybody's like, this has been nice. I know for me, for example, it's been amazing. It feels like a vacation. We haven't had to watch her eat. I haven't felt, well, I was going to say I haven't felt grossed out, but that would be a lie because watching now, I get pretty grossed out sometimes. But it's been like a vacation away from the food noises, the chomping, the food gasms, like all of that. Um, and then there's some people who are wondering where she is, if she's okay. Um, people are wondering if she had like a medical emergency. Somebody asked, did she pass away? Which obviously, well, I don't think that's even a thing because um, people keep an eye, I'm not saying this is right or wrong, on like her family's social media and they haven't posted anything. So um, some people think she's back in Canada. Some people think she's in the ER. I just think wherever she is, I'm glad it's been quiet. Where, where are they, Stella? I haven't missed Chantal at all. It's been really, really nice. It's been a nice break. It's, I, I don't know. I'm enjoying myself over here. She can stay gone as long as she wants to. Honestly, we're good and golden without her. It's true. Like, if she chooses not to come back, um, there's so many other topics. <laughs> there's so many other people to cover. We're good. If it's her second strike in three months, she's on a two week. Oh, you think so, Tara? Well, Let's enjoy another week without her. I mean, let's enjoy the peace and quiet. Um, we can eat without like wondering. <laughs> like, I don't know. She's ruined a lot of meals for me. She's ruined a lot of things for me. Oftentimes, if I was hungry when I started watching her, I wasn't hungry for like the next three days. Um, anyways, <laughs> times like these, I wish Breezy could work the poll chat option <laughs> so we could do. Yeah, we'll get to that. Don't even start me with the poll again. Whatever you do, don't cover me. Uh-oh, Panda. Uh-oh, don't give me any ideas. She has to come back. It's her only source of income. But is it? I was thinking about this earlier, to be honest. I was having a conversation. And remember how Foodie used to have feeders? Like, do we think they all just magically went away? <laughs> I think if she's not on YouTube, there's other sources of income coming in. That's just, I, I still think that there's people who love to watch her eat and will pay for her to videotape it. I was seriously videotape it like we're in the 80s. You know what I mean? Um, Breezy working that poll again. <laughs> right. He, hey, Eric, right. He was supposedly reaction channels would die without her, but we're strong and thriving. We've still been going live every day. I work out over here. I don't know about anybody else. I think everybody else is somehow surviving, though, too. I don't think she has secured enough feeders to support her. He said, you're right. She's definitely still recording for the feeders. I mean, I think so. I don't think um, things like that just magically stop. I don't think she started declining money. Um, and of course, if she's getting paid to eat, like she, I think she still has them. Hey, Susanna. Hi, friend. Hope you're enjoying this beautiful California day. It is beautiful out. It was beautiful out yesterday, too. Um, and good to see you. Your mom and Pete's and Natter are covering her. Must be getting bucks. 
Hey, everyone. Hey, beautiful regret running. Okay. All right. Let's get to Twitter. I'm going to end up just talking to you guys. Well, I love talking to you guys, but we'll never actually like talk about anything else if I just, okay. You get what I'm saying. Anyways, there's foodie posters that have gone up on Twitter. That is. <laughs> Mandy retweeted this one and it says, if found, it says missing. If found, do not assist. Leave her to sort out her own problems, including her wretched attitude, diabetes, foot, and bad smell. Please, information needed. There's been a few of these. All right, let's keep going. Nana Spike T said, how are Beauty Beauties Beezers handling their queen being gone for so long? Here we are enjoying the silence. My guess is that they're lost without her presence. Oh, I bet she's driving Poo Boy crazy. I bet she is. Well, I mean, if he's there, if he's there. We can always dream. Have you seen this hippo? Hey, Matthew, woof, woof. I think she definitely films for them, but I don't see it being enough to support her in salad. If that were the case, Hungry Fat Chick would just do that for sure. True. Hyde said, I'm in the South. Okay. He said, the photo is iconic and not in a queue. I would love people to see forever kind of way. I know, Eric. What is Ghostface doing without Foodie? Is Teardrop okay? I hope they are. Um, there's this clip about Yo Mama, and like I said, I don't know why anybody takes this guy seriously, but we're going to listen to him screech and yell at us about something, and then I'm going to show you the receipts, okay? The woman, y'all say that y'all call her out for her behavior, yet she's gone for seven days, and y'all just criticize her and hate on her some more, I, mm -hmm. and it's crazy. She, she got, I don't know, I don't know if she got suspended or not. But she's been gone for seven days and people say she got suspended. The woman. So people were saying that um, because you <laughs> right here, somebody asked, I'm assuming this is in your comment section, right? What happened to Foodie? She got a seven day strike. Okay, that's all. I just wanted to show that right there. We could carry on now. We could carry on. <laughs> The louder the volume, the lower the IQ. Now he's walking back that he said she was banned. Why does your mama suck up to her? Um, have you seen the clip about him and the 16-year-olds floating around out there? It's because birds of a feather flock together, and he is more like foodie and Salah than he wants people to realize. And that's my opinion. Go cry about it some more, your mama. All right, this is Henry. <laughs> And Henry is adorable. Oh my gosh. He's in Thousand Oaks. If you guys are looking to like adopt, you can find more info about Henry on Pet Finder. I did retweet it also if you want to go look for more info. Dr. Bone Eating Vulture said, if Chantel went to the Great Buffet in Hell suddenly overnight, do you think Salah would tell us? Yes. I think he would milk that for all it's worth. I think that he would go live and get super chats. I think he would be DMing with her beezers for emotional support. I think, yes, we would know. The only way your mama can make money on this platform is sucking up to foodie. True. Beatrix said Chantal loves perverts. Yep. Henry is perfect. I know. Henry is perfect. <laughs> so adorable. You haven't seen it, Tia? Uh, we played it during last night's stream. I could play it again at the before we go if you want to hear it. Um, yep, yep, retweeted this. Ugh, sorry, excuse for a man, and said this bloke is supposed to be thirty. Look at those crow's feet. Ain't no way this lad was in his twenties a few months ago. I'm guessing Foodie Beauty, formerly Everyday Miriam, married someone much closer to her age than she thinks. I don't know why I'm gonna zoom. I don't know. I don't really want to look at him. He, Him and Foodie have not aged well. That's what I'll say. <laughs> they have not aged well. I know he would probably tell Kevella for sure. Maybe a blonde and fishnets and a fishnet and a fish. <laughs> hey, Lurker. Hyde, can you imagine if the morality police showed up? Oh, my gosh. His beard is so... He's so just... Ew. I don't know. I don't want to stay here much longer, though. Thank you. I'm looking in the eyes of what I consider a pervert. Oh, I ended up somewhere. But here's Ray's tweet. Ray said, I don't normally post my projects from work, but April is Autism Acceptance Month. And having worked with autistic children for the last 17 years, it holds a place in my heart. So I just wanted to share. That's so cool. I love Ray. 
right? I don't know if you're in here right now, but I love you. Scammers lie about everything, so I'm sure he's older. He looks way older than what he says his age is. He does. There's a video going around on YouTube about your mama treating Shannon, then doubling down on it and saying it wasn't about Shannon. Is it, do you mean threatening Shannon? Desiree, I'm not missing her crap either. Ray does the cutest boards. Ray does the cutest everything. Cupcakes, everything. Now is a mod for foodie. Trash attracts trash. Facts. What did Salah threaten us with in Thailand? Like hitting us in the boobs or something? Can you guys remember what he specifically said? Sungopus said she's riding the camel, not a horse like Lady Cadaver in the dunes. I've got to wake up. Danielle said, I like facial hair, but his is just uncut. Yeah, facial hair looks nice if it's like clean and like brushed and trimmed and not like his looks like he's been out in the wild for a while and he just came back. I don't know. <laughs> it just looks messy and dirty on him. Like I feel like there's food all in there and it smells. Um, no, thank you. No, thank you is all I have to say. Oh, here's Henry again. So cute. All right, let's keep going. I cannot stand that man. All right. Foodie posters missing. Two-tailed said, us when our prized cow makes content. And then it's us when she disappears without a trace. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Wonder Mom said, dear Girl World, this time without foodie beauty is magical because you all are fun. Making up BS about what she is doing. Remembering the glory days of the villa. The boils, the rotting pot, the start of it all with Frank. I love you guys. And if she stays away, we will be fine. Seriously, though, I had to retweet that. Uh, this person said, me trying to do a reading with online tarot cards only to find out where Chantal is. All right. Did we find out where Chantal is? The, someone said, and. Oh, it says death. But it also says the slice, the, oh wait, the dog, the golden ball, but there's a sausage link. <laughs> Uh-oh, foodie. I guess let's hope not. Frank created a monster. Ray is a doll. Ray is a doll. ASMR the chew. Penny, good to see you. Ray is a unicorn for sure. I love her, he said. Me too. Hey, Paulina. All right, let's keep going. Big pitch said Chantel is in a diabetic coma. That's what I think. She ate herself into a medical emergency and is now in a hospital in Kuwait getting care. That's what happens when your blood sugar is out of control. She'll be out in like a week and resume eating herself to death. I don't know why I retweeted that, but there it is. I don't know. I don't, uh, I don't think she's in a coma. Would her family just be carrying on? I don't know. What do you guys think? The gift, wait, is death more about going into a new era of your life like change, not death? I don't know. Could it mean multiple things? Um, Let's see. It's all rainbows and unicorns said. May or may not be interesting. Social Blade is reporting that she's been getting between 3,000 to 3.7K thousand views per day since being MIA. Are these from people checking her channel and accidentally letting a video play? Could fans be playing videos to get her AdSense? Okay, so her views have gone up. That's pretty much. Um, Well, maybe in a documentary just dropped about her. So maybe people are like searching her name and finding these videos. Uh, people are also doing a lot of retro reacts, I noticed. That could be why. I think it's really strange that her family didn't post anything on their socials on her birthday. I think that points to a health issue. Maybe, Grace. Maybe. She's driving salad crazy, I'm sure. Yeah, if she's not in a coma like this one person thinks, I'm sure she's driving him nuts for food. She hasn't been able to rage at any of us, talk shit, make fun of anybody. Um, I just picture herself eating herself away, like eating into an oblivion. Uh, Salem said, y'all enjoy the quiet while it lasts. Don't be in such a hurry for this biatch to come back. And then I retweeted it and said, it's been so nice not having to see her eat. Um, she has been doing cameos though. So I, unless she's doing it from a hospital bed, gossip girl said foodie has only done two new cameos since her alleged band channel rebrand. Okay. Well, this one's from March 24th. And then this one's from April 2nd. 
Huh. Somebody posted her reviews too. I guess somebody left her like a bad rating. What is this? Right, fatties? It's time. Let's find her. Oh, it's another missing poster. Oh, I wish I didn't have to see her feet. I really wish I didn't. <laughs> the hashtag is find foodie. It says, right, fatties? It's time. Let's find her. This is her from both sides, a foot and hand and one of her faces. Where are you, Chantal? I don't know. I'm assuming she's eating somewhere. That's what I do know. That's what I do know. She doesn't have anyone to know that she's home or to know she's home. Chantel is like, now they aren't happy unless they're abusing people. It's true. I know always with the feet, right, Erin? Her feet are terrifying. Those toes were throwing king signs. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tia said, I knew you could buy subs, but views. And he said, she's too hard to hide. Yeah, that's true. Where is she going to hide? <laughs> Where is she going to hide? Scorpio Angel said, hmm, 8.01 p.m. Kuwait time. Chin still hasn't made an appearance online other than the sock account comments. Did that bee get a double dose of karma? Two strikes? That ish would be hilarious. I would find that amazing, to be honest. Uh, more of the, so or not Social Blade, her cameo. Oh, no, these are YouTube stats. Here's a screenshot of Foodie's YouTube stats. Stats the day the new docuseries episode aired versus today. She's only had 18,722 views since March 28th. Curious what her views will be when she finally does a comeback video or if there will be a spike at all. Okay, so this is just screenshots of her views and they've gone up in case you were curious. Oh, this is a clip of now, so just FYI, I don't know what she's going to say. Miss Robinson said, so, it, oh, now I know what it was going to say. So it was jingling when they shadow effed. Don't be jealous, you, yeah, and that's what it says. Okay, let me play it. I don't, I don't think I look good in collars. In collars? I think the bell is cute, though, because he likes bells, and it jingles when... <laughs> Uh, and she goes when we make love, so whatever. I don't think I don't know why, but hearing her say make love just made me feel so uncomfortable. Um, she's hiding in Pete's hot tub. <laughs> I think that foodie got in big trouble with YouTube. Possibly. That would be great. She's she like as much as she gloated when like certain channels got demonetized and everything else, um, and she was just like karma, karma. Well, if she got in big trouble with YouTube, that's her karma, and I love that for her. What is this? I retweeted something from Satan. Can't play it because there's music, but whatever it was, I'm sure it's good. <laughs> MD said she could disappear all she wants, but the audacity lingers forever. The audacity. And I guess she's deleting videos, you guys. This is from Yep Yep, who said, Why are so many Foodie Beauty, formerly Everyday Miriam's videos gone? Huh. Maybe she is in big trouble. More girl world hypocrisy is gone. The hate community of YouTube. Let's educate the ignorant. Okay. I have no words for this. Reaction night. Raging about a new series being made about me. Dipping sauce negligence. Taco Bell cheat meal. A makeup live addressing more lies. Interesting. Why delete so many if YouTube wasn't looking into her? It's true. Or she's getting deported. Jenny said, Hi, by the way. Jenny said, I don't know. I think there might be something medically going on. He said, Make Pete's show the hot tub. She could be under channel review. Oh, wow. So she could still end up losing her channel then. Um, failure to lunch said foodie did a cameo a few days ago and she got a low rating. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's funny. I'm sorry, but that's funny. Note for medical in Yavas. It was basically hypothesized that she is cleaning up her image and fear of the third and final strike. Wow. There's so many possibilities. Maybe a little bit of everything. The Kuwaiti ministry thing was constantly being tagged so much on Twitter. I saw that, Jenny. They may have looked into her. Freya said, or she's in the hospital in a coma. 
well, that would suck. Has she even been on any social media? I don't think so. I don't think so, but don't quote me on that. I don't know if anybody knows for an absolute fact. Panda, I agree. I think she's sitting on two strikes. Two strikes in two weeks. If it was a medical salon, I would have posted to their Beezers for medical funding. See, I think so too. Oh, here's Sheila. I think we saw Sheila last night, but she's so cute. Um, This, I think, is a troll. If you were in my stream last night, we saw this, but it was somebody like claiming that they saw Chantel. Um, but the way that they tried so hard screamed like troll to me. So it was, yo, Alex, I saw Chantel the other day. I did, LMAO. Salah was walking like six miles away from her. Chantal was super tired and was taking a break sitting on a booth. And Salah's like a million miles standing away from her on his phone. I didn't dare talk to her. It was at the city center mall in Kuwait City. She looks super short in real life. <laughs> I literally felt secondhand embarrassment. I didn't want to take any pics because I was so close to her, so I couldn't. It isn't my first time seeing Chantal, though. Kuwait is pretty small, and I live in the same area as Chantal. They just tried way too hard with all of that. If they mentioned something like once, maybe, or like twice, I would have been like, interesting. Like, let's keep an eye on it. But because they kept saying Chantel and oh, Chantel, like, okay, calm down. <laughs> Who went live? Who went live? Foodie? Hold on. Please tell me. Oh my gosh, you, you guys, she is back. She is back. All right, give me a second. Please give us a rage. That's all I want. <laughs> all right, let me share the screen. Thank you guys for letting me know. What are the odds that she was watching right now? <laughs> all right. Can you guys see it okay? I guess we're going to wait for her. Should we go get snacks? I know, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. She's in Canada. Oh my gosh. This is going to be amazing. Hold on. Oh wait, I forgot you guys could see my screen. Oh no, you can't right now. Okay. I got to change my title of this video while we have time. And that's a new outfit, right? Have we seen her in this? She's in Canada. Oh my gosh. All right, hold on, you guys. Go get your snacks. She's in the list or in the Kia. Is that what you meant to say? All right. Foodie beauty. Hold on, you guys. So, if she is, in fact, in Canada, later tonight, you guys, we're going to do a Twitter recap of everything. Breezy, read the chat. Foodie's chat? Okay, I was changing the title really fast. Queen Mother Madonna Miriam. We missed you, Chantal. I think she wore that in Thailand. Oh, okay. I'm like, I don't remember that, but I feel like she's been wearing the same thing for months now, so. <laughs> Joe, hey. Yeah, that's a new shirt, Danielle said. She's in Canada. Natter got a huge grocery haul and doesn't have a car. Oh my gosh. Breezy, get the fruit cups ready. You know what? I should. You guys, go get your snacks really fast. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to get a fruit cup and probably a soda. <laughs>
I guess people forgot about me. <laughs> uh oh, I might have to move. I don't know if this is private property or not. I'm kind of confused. Like, um, okay, so I'm in this little driveway, and then there's a fence that says no trespassing. So does that mean no trespassing before the fence or after? Hi. Oh my gosh, it's too fast. Hi everyone. I'm kind of nervous and overwhelmed. So, and I have to let a little chin free. I can't. I feel claustrophobic. Okay, I'm back, you guys. Hi. I don't even know where to start. What like, happened? Seven days and my, or eight days or however many days. And my life has like changed so much that I don't even know where to start. What? I have so many stories I wanted to tell you guys. Okay. Like, when something happens in my life, I'm like, I have to tell them this. Did they break up? Like being away made me realize like you guys are my support system. Hi, everybody. <laughs> She's so happy. <laughs> well, it comes to Lam. Hello, everybody. I need to let a little bit of my chin out. Well, yeah, I'm in the Kia. Yeah. No, so I'll let me take the. It doesn't. Does the Kia look like? No, it's not white. Hi. Hi. Hi, everybody. <laughs> I miss so many people to say hi, so I'm just gonna say a collective hi. I am literally jet lagged. I know people laugh and use that as like a, a euphemism for being high. No. It does look like new glasses. That's creepy. I'm just like literally so tired. And my body is so battered from this trip. I am going nuts. <sighs> so why are you there? Yeah, I have new glasses. So, you know, I did the prescription, right? Like I went to the eye doctor last time I was in Canada. But then I left without getting glasses. They're super expensive here. So before I left, so I was like, give me your prescription for your glasses. I'm going to go and get you glasses. Uh -huh. And I was like, no, we don't need. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> For the birthday wishes and everything welcome i'm like we, you know we don't that's not a priority <laughs> and even though i'm driving yeah I, uh, it's much better I, i'm like why haven't i gotten these sooner so he went and got glasses for me before i headed out so I'm, I'm assuming they're not broken up because she keeps talking about him glad he did they're still pricey over there though i mean they look good hi guys she isn't wearing her Abaya. I just, uh, this, the key is all set. It got has new brakes. Has wow. like $2,000 worth of work on this baby. I feel like I'm in a new car. I love this Kia. It looks clean. Let's never fight. Anyways. All right. So. Hi. I missed all you guys. Sorry. I missed like all everybody. Hey. Mary. Are we at the outhouse? Hexie. Hey. How you doing? Brittany. Everyone I missed. All the Beezers. Did I miss everyone who is in? Sorry. Hello. I missed you guys. Um. Thank you. Happy belated. Um, no. Just a friendly reminder before she actually went live, someone in our chat let us know that Natter had a huge grocery haul, I guess, recently. So she must be back in Canada. Do we think that they saw each other? No name. Happy belated. <laughs> Thank you. No name. <laughs> Thank you. We're jumping right in there. Thanks. I look cute. No, I don't feel it. Hi. Okay. You look clean. Um, I have so much to talk about. I, I was bees. Hexy, I know. Okay, so am I in a private spot? All right. You were so worried. Well, let me tell you what happened. Okay, tell us. So, thank you guys. Everybody, who did I miss? I missed a lot of, I think I missed some beezers here. That was dry. It does look like a Medea Hi. dress. Thanks, guys. For uh, it's going so fast, Joey. Um, Ghostface. Uh, Look at the super this. chat. Is this your property? People driving by. Anyway, they come and say happy belated birthday. You know? Yeah, this is a new dress. Like the minute I decided to come back to Canada, I was like, I'm going on Pennington's.com. Oh, All right, let's get some clothes because, like, I need Canada clothes. You know. Uh huh. And that's Canada so, clothes. This is like a dress, but it's so cool. It's gonna be nice and cool. Cassidy, happy belated birthday. Missed you lives. Thank you so much, Cassidy. That's so sweet of you. Heather Golden Girl. Hi, oh, thank you. Comic Brook Flowers Bonnie. Hi, Comic Brook. Boo boo. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. Are those Canada clothes? clothes? Obsessively. Anyways, okay. So okay. I got a strike on my channel. She did. And uh at first I was like, what the F? You know, I was like pissed off. I was like. I have a strike on my... Rosemary! Hi, Marbles. Kayla! See? 
Trixie, you guys look horrible. Teaser. Thank you. Ready to start reading these. <laughs> okay, sorry, I have to concentrate. Sorry. Hi, Carolina. Never have I ever Paul freed everybody. Normally, Mimi, Shelly. <laughs> I know. Okay, listen. <laughs> so basically, um, and I was like, what? What? You know? Uh huh. But then, like, I saw like the hey, post Tom. that I made. Like, I deleted it, but it's about the. Po- it was for the post that. Thanks, mistress. Which Girl post that I made about that Matthew? She does seem high, Kalani lady. So that's why. Okay. At first, I was mad, and I'm like, I'm like, you know what? It doesn't matter. Like because I was responding to, I was triggered as usual, but that's my problem to be triggered. But anyway, I was triggered because I saw parts of a video on your mama's live stream about her, and she was like you know, calling me heifer and that my husband wouldn't touch me. So I, you know, said some nasty things back. So, mm-hmm. but you know what? It doesn't matter. I got caught for it. I think it's weird that, you know. All I know is what I just heard is your mama got you banned because you raged because of his live stream. Okay, carry on. That YouTube doesn't, you know, keep the same energy for some other channels that swear and all that. But what I said was really nasty. So, you know what? I'm like, fine. I, what I did was wrong. I'll take the hit. I'll take the L. And you know what? I think it's a sign from God or from whatever, the universe, whatever you want to believe, uh-huh. that I needed that break. Like, this break has been amazing for me. And I know that's going to annoy you and it's going to make people mad, but it was so amazing. It doesn't make me mad because life has been amazing without you, to be honest. But I get it. sit and chat here for a while. <sighs> You thought it fell into the drain. So, anyways, basically the 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 break was awesome, you know. So, yeah, I was like, yeah, you know what? I was nasty. Like, doesn't matter if I'm being nasty back, whatever. Like, I'm the my point is, uh huh. Like, I need to just ignore these people and really just bees. Focus on beesing. Focus on. And I missed you. You're high. That's why you're all, oh, who? It doesn't matter. Like, because you're high. Because you're high. When you get back to Kuwait, if you go back, you'll be angry again. We've heard this before. It doesn't matter. You just want to bees and let bees and yeah, whatever. You guys so much. Like, you guys are my support system. I realize that in a lot of ways. Like, I have to just try to make it in a healthy in a healthy way. Like, hey, Jamie. Um, so, yeah, I have to be positive because you know what? YouTube is a popularity contest. A lot of people don't like me. So any little a way lot. they can, obviously they're going to report me, right? Especially if I do something that um, goes against terms of service. And if I get caught, that's like, is it worth risking my entire channel for going after every little like people who are saying like that I'm a pig, you know, like, no, I needed to check my behavior. It's like oh. my mental health, everything. So basically mm-hmm. this, this break was amazing. And I made a very big decision to. So people calling you a pig ruins your mental health, not the fact that you eat 24 hours a day? To, um, move back to, to Canada. And honestly, if I had my way and I was rich, I would probably bounce back and forth all the time. No, you're not, you know what? I wouldn't. Huh. This journey, <laughs> journey. You, this is one of the stories, okay? This journey? I want to tell you one of the stories of the horrors of being on the plane this time. All right. So normally, sorry, I'm just getting this out and I'll talk to you guys and save your questions if you want to. But I normally fly with Qatar Airways or Emirates. I I know I'm like, I only fly with Qatar. No, but there's a reason. All right. This time I decided, you know what? Okay. If I go with Qatar or Emirates, Mm -hmm. I'm on the plane for 13 hours straight because the transfer is only an hour of flight. Toasty, I think Salah's already in somebody's DMs telling him that he wants to shit on them later. That's what I think. In Qatar, <laughs> wait to Qatar, then 13 hours, Canada, Montreal. But if I try a different route where Lufthansa, which is a German airline, I booked, I, I, so I, I went from Kuwait to Frankfurt on Lufthansa. Then I had an almost three hour layover in Frankfurt and then I had to Hi guys. <laughs> um, not fl- someone thinks she got kicked out of Kuwait. Really, DL? Air Canada, but they were both Airbus A three three zeros, which you know, they're not the Boeing Max. <laughs> I was just happy about that. So then, um, basically, I thought, okay, I'm gonna break it in half. It's not as bad. My mm-hmm. body won't be as bad. Or oh, I didn't like Lufthansa. Oh my gosh, it's not terrible. Okay, 
But like I found the staff was not that friendly. There were more Are we at the outhouse, you guys? Because that would explain a lot. Like her skin is all I don't know how to explain it, but like when you get high, how it kind of gets flushed and red and blotchy. <laughs> like it's like that, and she's just a whole new woman now. Snappy. Um the food was okay. Here's the food. Okay. So on Seriously, the first flight. Baby. They gave me, they give you a sandwich. It's like this long. Okay. Nikki, move back permanently. Sell off, sell off following you. Okay. Hi, Lily Boy. I'll tell you guys in just one second. Okay. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Tina, for the super chat. Tell us you're broke without telling us. Exactly. <laughs> Hi, by the way. Thank you so much for the super chat. And then I'll check the comments. I have to get this out. <laughs> okay. Tell us. Tell us. So, yeah. Guitar is super nice. Um, Basically, um, what was I gonna say? They give you a sandwich, and it's their vegetarian sandwich, a vegetarian sandwich. And so I'm like, okay, like oh literally, that's how the attendant talked. A vegetarian sandwich, just like, like that. It. And um, it had cream cheese. Okay, the cream cheese. I don't know, mess with my gut. So that's digesting. <laughs> By the time I get to the second leg of my, you know, the Air Canada. I'm like, please don't let anyone sit beside me. Please don't let anyone sit beside me. And Wait, Freya, she's only got one more strike left. So what if somebody decided to strike one of her bowling live streams or videos that's still up? That'd be interesting. And uh, and I, like, I was literally praying, like, please don't let anyone sit beside me, Allah, please. Well, this guy comes bouncing down the, wa the, the, the walkway. Sits bouncing right down. Me, and he's listening to super loud music, like dance hall music i don't know if you know what dance hall is i'm so sure someone is mm -hmm. anyway he sits down and okay whatever I, I slept most of the flight he ordered wine you get like complimentary little bottles of wine on air canada he ordered wine and he spilt red wine on my clothes twice twice so i smelled like twice a bottle of booze i have to let up some chin sorry Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she just got jealous of all the attention Nal's getting. That's why she's back to this. And oh, I have to let out some of my chins. By the way, you guys don't have to delete me messages. Just let people talk. But oh wow, really, like really hateful, racist stuff. You know what I mean? Okay, so um, or is she trying to resuscitate her channel? I'll get to. I have a lot to talk about, so I need to get it out. What was I gonna say? So I'm not even really looking at the comments right now. So they can just go with talk if you want. I don't care. Okay. All right. So um, I have a few things I'd like to say in there. That's when the sandwich starts hurting my stomach. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, it's gurgling. For some reason, the cream cheese or something in that sandwich gave me the ultimate gas. It was the probably the worst gas attack I ever had in my life. Uh -huh. And we're like, the the captain was like, okay, we have 20 minutes left till landing. Because, you know, landing is a whole process. They got to go down, 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 down. So there's like a right. gaggle of geese having an orgy in the background and I'm freaking out. Listen. Oh my gosh. Yep. Who is this new foodie beauty? Well, it's not really new. I feel like she's becoming like, or she's going back to the old, old foodie beauty. Like she wouldn't be talking about this stuff in Kuwait. Well, she couldn't. Anyways, and I'm like, okay, I can hold it. Cause I'm not about to go. Cause you know, when you're landing, they say, okay, the lock, the, she's the high. bathrooms are going to be locked. So I couldn't go. I had to go. Like I had to go number two. I had to go. You know what I mean? And I, and I have no gallbladder. So I'm like, did you get a good deal on that snow that you allegedly picked up at the outhouse? We'll, we'll wait for landing. So we land. And then you know how you have to wait to deplane. Okay. Mm -hmm. Chantel's red wing. I'm shook. Chantel, any of you my welcome home. Thank you. Thanks, We're talking guys. a mile a minute. Out. Sam broke up his life. We went, Chantel. Her tattoos even showing? Uh -huh. We told you so. You told me what? I don't even get what. Is that? A, oh, that's a hate comment? Oh, that's okay. You don't have to delete that. I don't care what they say. Wow. Okay, it takes forever to deplane. The, everyone's just standing there, like, waiting for them to, to open the door. And I'm like, yes, I'm going to get to go. I'm, like, clenching hard. I need to go. Then we're all standing up. I oh my grab my luggage from the overhead bin. And the guy's like, okay, everyone sit back down because immigration is coming on board. And I was like, what? 
No, no, they're going to like investigate people. Why do you have to hold up the whole plane to investigate one person trying to get into Canada? You know, and like, I'm like, oh no, I can't make it. I'm so sick from this sandwich. And like, oh my gosh. She's barely stopping to like breathe or anything. I couldn't hold it. I She's so high. was like, I couldn't hold, like, I'm like, I can't. Anyway, somehow miraculously I did. They would check her passport. Like they checked everyone's passport. Uh -huh. So that's the story on that. So now being in Canada. Yeah. Tell us all about it. Hi everybody. Nice to see you. Sorry. I didn't look at the comments really. Um, I'm moving here. Um, oh, I can't stand the summer in Kuwait. Okay. It's bad for my health. Yeah. That's um, bad for your health. Free healthcare because even no matter what my visa status would be there, I don't want to talk about that, but it would be expensive. So just think of, make whatever you want of that. If you want to think that I have this visa, that visa it doesn't matter. It's okay. Fine. Whatever. But it is expensive. <laughs> Just say that. Okay. Who's going to babysit Salah? So um, I'm not divorced. I'm still with Salah. And how is that going to work? I'm taking things day by day and letting, leaving, honestly, this, you know, you're going to think it's cringe, but I'm leaving it up to God. Like, I'm just going to control what I can control in my life and not worry so much so like because like honestly when i'm dead the anxiety that what i'm worried about won't matter uh -huh. you know i'll be like <laughs> honestly when you i don't know i just i have to worry about myself it's over yeah it's over he's gone how long do we think that she's gonna play like keep up with this they're still together act it told me a lot when she was like i'm just gonna take it day by day Nikki P. Browning, are you going to move in with me? Oh, he's going to be sperming everywhere for everybody else. Oh, she's addressing Pete. Hold okay, on. So I hope you have help. Hold Thank on. you. I'm not sure what I'm doing at all. Like, I am definitely getting an apartment. Like, I, I need to get my own setup here. Uh -huh. So I need to set up everything, which means I have to, like, get everything from scratch. Like, I'm not rich. Like, I, we are okay. Like, we do fine. Like, we were able to, like, you know, everything. Fix the car. Um, Get me here, which mm -hmm. was, like, crazy. Um, I also kind of feel like she's broke, you guys. Like, aside from the side hustle we thought that she had going on with the feeders, I think she's broke. Um, it was a cheaper, though, on those two flights, but I I'm never going to compromise. This. I can't. It's too... Air Canada is really good, though. Air Canada, the only thing is they don't have personalized vents. I was almost dying. Um, I'm also getting Sam back. <laughs> what? Like... I'm getting Sam back when I get my place. The foster lady. Um, what about Julia? She's like, after all, she had a cat before Sam, an older cat. And he doesn't really like Sam. I thought they were getting along, but no. No, 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 no. Absolutely. Thank you, Jessica. You know what? No, I'm not worried about, I'm not going to worry about that. Like, I have my trust and renewed trust. I said I would do it, like trust, like. And, you know, like, I'm just going to live life. Like, whatever happens, happens. You know, I'm not going to stress about that. I'm not going to, there's nothing I can do. I don't have a, I'm not a fly on the wall over there. I can't live my life distrusting somebody, you know, like, I can't waste that energy. Um, if I ever learn of something that's different, I'll deal with it. But I'm not. What about your pets, though, back in Kuwait? And please don't get, I'm sorry, you don't need a pet at all. Like, you can't take care of yourself. I'm not going to. No, I'm going to focus on myself. Um, hey, Sandra. Yeah, I just, there's a lot of things I, I miss, like, that I didn't think I would ever miss when I first moved to Kuwait. And when I got here, I was, like, very patriotic. I was like, Canada! But a lot of people on the plane were looking out, and they were like, you could tell they missed Canada. Like, you get homesick, but I also, now I miss Kuwait a lot, too. Because when uh -huh. you're, you ingrain yourself in a culture... For a year and a half or however long I was there, it's like, you know. How did you ingrain yourself when you were stuck in an apartment all the time? And my, I miss Julia and Harry so bad. But what about them? Like, that's like, no matter which country I'm in, I have heartbreak because I miss my cats here. And then I miss Julia, like her little face and her fishy breath. <gasps> but Salah is a good cat dad. I don't want to leave him. Like He genuinely, genuinely looks sad at the thought of leaving Julia. Uh -huh. Hi, Squeaky. Yeah, Sarah Jean. 
Hi, Brittany. Ghostface. Inshallah, he can come here. Yeah. No, I'm not here to renew my visa. He hated animals. That move he used to, Half Light. He I turned it down to. a little. Is that better? He was not an animal person. He was not raised with pets. He could care less about them before. He didn't hate them. Like, you know, he wouldn't hurt anything, but he fell in love with Julia. In love. Like, there's not he about about 15 times a day. I oh I can I'm like, are you harassing the cat again? <laughs> because he oh grabs gosh. her and holds her and just kisses her for like five minutes straight. And someone in our chat pointed out that Salah is not in his fake wife's chat. She doesn't persist, but she you, you know how cats look whenever you hold them, they're like, Do you hear the geese? <laughs> Anyways. So are you going to continue to dress like this? And... <sighs> Suspensory time for wheelchair bees. I can't blink it. And it seems like you guys think she's been deported. Um, yes, of course I miss him. <laughs> All the time. Yeah. No, Ramadan's not over. I didn't have to fast while I was traveling. Uh-huh. Um, Did you fast really at all? And, yeah, I don't know. I haven't really been doing that right now. Um, but, yeah, what do you have questions about? C creepy comfort and crime! Thank you! Oh, yeah, I can like the comments. Welcome back. You've been missed. Oh, thanks. I'm glad you guys missed me. Nicolina. I think she already got the wheelchairs, and I think she's already been to the outhouse, too. I did. I let it go on the plane so bad I couldn't hold it. Oh, my gosh. It was like, like a machine gun with mixed with a tuba. <laughs> I have a question. Are you jealous that everybody else has been watching Queen Cobra now, and they said that she took your place? I'm religious, so I don't care. Here's the thing. There's religion and there's culture, okay? I'm Canadian, like, blood-wise, and we believe in the medicinal power of marijuana, so... That's something I'm going to consider because, um, you know, I know it would be frowned upon by most Muslim people, but uh -huh. for me, it's like, I don't know. It's like medicine for me. I feel like having like a night when I get home, like whenever, you know, you, you do your whole day, be productive. And then later at night for a treat, like to relax, it's like medicine. Look, it helps with like, you know. The CBD and that can help with pain. I can't. Dude, you're over explaining. You don't have to convince anybody else about the medicinal effects of marijuana. Like most of us believe in it. But I, are you trying to convince yourself that it's okay? Because that you're doing too much. Take too many more NSAIDs. Like my stomach is going to have a hole like this big inside it. You know, so. But I'm still Muslim. I still believe in, in God. And like, how can I, you know. How can I just automatically, uh, you know what? You can stop believing. People switch all the time. People go through struggle. You know, uh -huh. I think religion is something very personal, you know? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Sabriana! Glad you were okay. Are you going to drop the perfect, modest Muslim act? I really want to know. Was worried your mouth got you in trouble. Be safe and not talk personal business online or speak ill of others. You're right. Thank you. Thanks for the super chat, Nikki Bean. Oh going. my gosh. We like honesty. Less hate for when this. you're being real. Thank you. Thank you. She seems in a good you mood. Guys, I know you guys are all happy because like this is the land of the bees. Yes. For the land of the bees. Oh no, that's the American. The geese is getting on my nerves. Anyways, I was thinking as a celebration, uh -huh. let's go eat somewhere. Okay. But I'm going to come back live when I get there because... <laughs> You know the rules. Who's Rosemary? Whose personality did you borrow today? Look happier. But what you said was true. What did I say? Hi, Rebe. Hi, everybody. Who did I miss? Rebe, because of chronic pain. Yeah, that's to me. It's like medicine, you know. Sushi. Jessica, your 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 channel's been blowing up, huh? Oh, uh, is Jessica Mesca in the chat? Yeah, thanks, <laughs> Golden Girl. Lolo, everybody, crab legs. Child, Carol Chimes, our home in Beezing Land. <laughs> what did you say? Oh, Canada, our home in Beezing Land. I'm excited. True. I'm excited because I feel like it's not going to be so boring and stale now. But um, 
I don't know. I still think she's high, and this is weird. Ooh, home of the bees. Imagine I'm getting King Beezer back, and I'll never leave him again. So it just happened to work out that he's not getting along with another cat or whatever BS story you just told us at the same time that you decided to move back to Canada. The stars just all aligned and it worked out like that. Pretty soon he'll be strumming on a new counter. Or did you have an agreement for like the time you were going to be in Kuwait for your alleged marriage contract? I can't go back to Kuwait yet. <laughs> Can you? Thank you, no name. Sham. Kuwait. Look, I love Kuwait. And I do miss Salah like a lot. It's so hard being in a long distance marriage and for who who knows how long. But this is like a sacrifice uh. I have to make. And it'll be a true test of our relationship too, because you know, like that long of distance, no. We'll see, you know, and I, I'm here to like, also, I have to work on myself, but I need a plan. So on the 18th, I have like a. It's not going to work. Therapy session. Oh. But I'm like starting immediately because I have help from my family to like, you know, help me get in places and stuff. Um, Did you get bad news about your health? My makeup, I don't have a lot on. Can we go in the handbag? I missed that. Oh. <laughs> down under. <laughs> um, yeah, soon, sometime soon. Yeah. If yes, of course I miss him, and I don't want to shit talk him. Like that's the only thing I ask. Let's just not talk about him. You can have your opinions, but just mm -hmm. keep them to yourself. Like you know, just he is my husband, and you know it's important for me. Like a little bit of respect for that. Well, that's not going to happen, but I have a request because I think you guys are over and going to break up. The next person you date, can you like try out their woofs and make sure that it doesn't sound like woof, woof, woof and like they have a much more, I don't know, some bass or something to their bark? I don't know. It needs to be a little bit more intimidating or something. Lolo, 34 months. Girl, I knew it. Felt you were back. I'm glad you were taking care of you. Thank you. Ready, set, rebies. But we're just going to be, thank you so much, Lolo. We're going to be, um, yeah, someday he can visit. But, like, for now, I'm just, fo I have to focus on me and, you know, beezing. <laughs> the woof and try out. Pets. Don't worry about them. He's taking really good care of them. I hope And so. I, like, talk to him every day, you know, on video to see, okay, this is the pet situation, you know. Yeah, find a real man with a real woof woof. <laughs> Hi, Tracy. Yeah, because uh, what do I miss about him? Everything, like just having that person there with you. Like I feel lonely. I feel lonely and blue. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So lonely whoa. and blue. <laughs> Hold on. That was I feel really lonely cool. and blue. I won't torture you. Without you, baby. Without you. Okay. I I, I could do without all this. My makeup on. I feel like I'm living out my car. Maybe I am. Ah! Oh. Uh, you know that song? I want my MTV. My nose hairs. Can you please stop whatever is happening right now? I need to go forward. And that's the way you do it. Play the guitar on the MTV. Oh my gosh, I want out of this. Goodbye. <laughs> do we want to go to real time? People are telling her to go get a wheelchair. Or do you want me to speed it up? I could actually, let's speed it up until I find out. Just be in all the time, you know? Mm -hmm. In the summer, it's worse. I'm going to be in. I cannot go outside. I will die there in the summer. You will die That's there? I'm not one with the sea. Nikki P, thanks, Nikki P. Yeah, it's normal to have time apart. Thanks, Millie. Please, Nikki So if She's high, definitely, Elaine. Um, what was I going to say? Applebee's, Twisty Misty. Yes, we're going to do all those things. Just give me time. Oh, okay. I want to go eat somewhere. Let's go fight some people at the BQ. How should we start the fight, Hexy? You know, Joe, I was hoping she would go after me, but she seems like she's in like a really good mood. She, you know, she's high, so she she doesn't care about going after me right now. Thanks, Marvels. Maybe tomorrow. No, they don't have Nashies right now. I'm disappointed. Haunted, uh, haunted places, yes. Harvey's. I got a bunch of things. Cheryl Pennington's from Pennington's. <laughs> Cash up what? Yeah, um, orange tulip. So I have to go thrift shopping or something for all new house stuff. Oh. Dollar Tree has plates and things. Mm -hmm. 
Yo, mama, stuck on a roller coaster? Agatha, what's up? Sam, Sam, in here. Hey, Tracy. Did you just say your mama is stuck on a roller coaster? How are you doing? Today truly is an amazing day. <laughs> a handful of ice cream? No, I don't want to go to jail. Hi, Jenna. What? Thanks, Georgia girl. Do I have Cash App? I have PayPal. My PayPal for what? Hugh. Um, um. Hold on. What did you say, Hugh? For Breezy getting this quick, if anyone isn't blocked, go drop that Breezy is sniping. Do it for the Breezy bunch. Oh, and I love you, Breezy. I love you too, Hugh. Thank you for being a member for two months. What was I going to say? I don't know. All right. I'm going to go to real you. time. We have tornadoes? No way. All right. Yeah. Because they always say the dealership's scamming you. Well, this guy wasn't much cheaper. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go with the actual Ikea. Was it OEM parts or something? Like original Kia parts and they guarantee their work. And sorry, I need to clean. we need to clean the Kia, man. Right, so, right. Yeah, that was insane. Okay, there we go. Ray said, let's hope there's no 16 year olds on that roller coaster. I'm telling you. I cannot show my hair. No wife leaves her husband if you love him. Yeah, but I also love myself. So I'm here to work on myself. Anyways, that's our business, right? Oh, I, don't, I can't pin my oh. PayPal. They're over. Oh, you guys are sweet. You don't have to. But if you want to, my PayPal is. <laughs> I don't know how to pin. I'm on my phone. It's C. Okay, get ready to write it down if you want to. But you don't have to. But if you do, thank you. Okay, so it's C S A R A. Is that my PayPal? E is that my PayPal email? Yeah. C S A R A at no, no, I just look up Foodie Beauty. PayPal.me backslash Foodie Beauty. Yeah, that's what it is. Thank you, Miss Linda. Welcome home. Ready for support. That part right there. This isn't a woman who is sad because she's missing her man. Exactly. She is so happy now. Supporting the new, supporting the new villa glow up. Yeah, I want to have like a bed rot bees era. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. A bed rot I'm bees? I'm joking. Independent woman. That's the arc. Yeah. <laughs> Docs. <laughs> Can't wait for the foodie videos. Yeah. I think Natter is too. Remember, he just got a huge grocery haul. Someone in our chat said that and that he doesn't drive and like she's suddenly back in Canada. Hmm. I miss, honestly, I do miss like my, my content was. I don't know. My PayPal's my stale. It was stale. Joe said, I would have loved to see the, his face when he dropped off. Same Joe. I bet he looked like so amazing. He had a glow, a sparkle in his eye. Anyways, thank you so much for being a member for 12 months. That's amazing. I love you, Joe. Okay. My hotmail is CSARA084 at hotmail.com. Yeah. CSARA084 at hotmail.com. Or paypal.me backslash fruity beauty. Or you can request a cameo and get your cameo now. Yeah. So I want to like, we have the Pennington's bees. We have Tia, thank you for being a member for 22 months. She seems like she's on snow. Yeah, it sure seems like it to me. That's why I was asking if we could tell if she's by the outhouse. <laughs> I have to do all the beesing. Like in Love you, Tia. Kuwait, like, I liked living in a different culture and I liked... Um, I don't, I, I like like both places, so it's like really hard for me. I feel very conflicted, like, and I feel like an identity crisis a little bit. Uh huh. Yeah. You're just now figuring out you're having an identity mm -hmm. crisis. Go for a million, yeah, Jack. Hi, Don. Welcome. Let's speed her up. <laughs> the green. Kuwait is the saddest. Like, why was it depressing for you guys? Just because you you guys are used to me having such an outgoing personality to being completely muted or what? <clears throat> That's what it was, right? Hi, Georgia girl. So that's good. Someone told her your energy changed. No, I have not seen the new documentary on me. Yeah, right. That was not me. Well, I think a lot of it is cultural. I don't think it's like hot on to laugh at farts. But I could be wrong. I don't know. Hmm. Someone told her you missed the sad. freedom. No, I was like happy there, but like, yeah. Were you? You were happy I eating. Like, I wanna break free. <laughs> I wanna break free and eat chicken pot pie with some nashies. No, I have to get healthy, but first I need to like. You know what I'm excited about, you guys? This means we're gonna be live a lot more and get to hang out. That'll be a lot of fun. A celebration. Admit it. Thank you, Charlene. Thank you guys for the birthday wishes. Was she was Danielle. I miss driving. Like I love. I was driving down the the long road singing. I can see see you. <laughs> the boys of summer song. 
I love that. I'm, I don't have any plans to go back to Kuwait. I don't have a return ticket. I oh, have a place here. Oh, down under. Thank you. So you guys are over. Hello, everyday Mariams in our chat. Joining me, bees, where's the bees? So we need a bees army again, so we can go marching into the bees. I tried my best. Thank marching you, Joey. Into the bees. These classes. Maybe SUP someday. I don't know. I'm just taking it day by day now. No widow too young. Kiana, like even if I like taking off your hijab, no, I can't. I'm not doing that. Did you catch him cheating again? I want to come up with different hijab styles. Should I ask that in her like, chat? You know, I don't know how to explain it. Like a more Western hijab style. And when I'm over there, I dress in abayas and hijabs, like you know, when in Rome. <laughs> A bees means yeah we can bees in a huge Ray thank you so much for the super chat as much as I dislike her vile actions I'm genuinely happy she's okay back in Canada and she already seems so much happier love you Breezy I love you too Ray and thank you so much for the super chat thank you thank you she does seem very very happy she does job and I don't I, I ate a non halal chicken sandwich at the airport by the way uh oh I was so hungry because I was like after I didn't eat like anything on the plane. Air Canada because of the fact that uh, my stomach was so bad. So by the time I did so much walking, my body feels so bad right now. Teardrop, hi! Glad you're safe. I was worried. Thank you, Teardrop. Sorry if I missed you when you came in. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, you can decide what being Muslim means to you. It's personal, exactly. There's no compulsion in Islam. Like they say, you're not, uh -huh. you know, like certain things anyways. It doesn't even say in the Quran, you have to wear a hijab on your head. It's interpreted that way by scholars, but mostly what it is verbatim that's like to cover make like loose clothing so you can't see the form of your body like don't dress like what we would call skank dress you know skank which i used dress? to do yeah but i don't miss that i like to be covered up no I do. I, you I, had I, the coochie dress that's what we call it foodie the coochie dress 40 i want to kind of start dressing my age uh-huh not that if you want to dress you know like that when, when you're oh, 60 that's no problem Tina, but for, welcome to the breezy bunch thank you so much for joining for me i think i like you know like this stuff like i don't know you look like um, a tablecloth or like curtains. I want to go walking too, Ribia. Original doll! My, the doll I was going to get for my birthday. Rich Maybe even wallpaper in a bathroom. <laughs> Welcome. All right, let's go to real time. Oh, wait. There we are. Oh, no, I don't have my wig. She Maybe. does. <laughs> she does, JP. Thank you, Lynn. Um, Lynn, the other, my glasses are new. No wine. I'm not going to drink alcohol. But, uh, no. Turbo 2. Yeah, to right. <laughs> Someone asked her if she's been following go. Queen Cobra. Thank you, everybody. Michelle. I'm going to my nose. So I'm pretty much just going to bees around the bush. We're going to bees around the bush. <gasps> Ray! Some no. Ray just gifted five Breezy Bunch memberships. Stella got one. JB. Poppy. Oh, my gosh. Athe got one. Nicole. Welcome, you guys. And thank you so much, Ray. That was so sweet of you. You guys... Welcome to the Breezy Bunch and feel free to use the little sticker emoji things. They're really cute. You guys no, are no. so awesome. How many look at? Yeah, I can have one, one more pill. You know, you guys are so good to me. Thank you. Because that's my brand is Foodie Beauty, you know? Butterfly, member for seven months. Hoochie dress. Now grandma dress. Maybe the boring arc is over other than the wardrobe. Maybe. I hope so. Thank you for being a member for seven months. <sighs> His incorporate hero. Right, there we go. I'm looking for my Kleenex. Oh wait. <gasps> I was from what said Breezen's rent is due. You're back. Not a moment too soon for her. Thank you. Put out of Kuwait <laughs> by the Islamic <laughs> radicalists. No, I wasn't. They're not there's no radicalists in Kuwait. I'm glad you're concerned about my rent, but thank you. I already paid it. I'm good. Those are mostly I'm good. in Syria, <laughs> Afghanistan, Pakistan. Not the Gulf countries. Maybe Saudi Arabia. No. I don't know. <laughs> Can we get a Pete's Beast, please? Oh, gosh. Oh. Do you think she's going to go back to flashing us again? Sorry. Sorry, I'm gross. And OF. <laughs> oh yeah, I was listening to so I was listening to the Dire Straits. I need to I can't go to eat. My hijab is slipping. Pakistan bees. Cola knows, yeah. <laughs> Hi Miss Linda. Did it Brenda know? P 
Pete's Beast, please. He's working. Yeah, she said she was for a week. Uh huh. Yeah. What do you want for your birthday? I don't know. My birthday's over. <laughs> Hope a cop and celebrity with cause I would. <laughs> I had a decent birthday. Hi, Ribby. What'd Happy belated birthday. Thank you, Ribby. Thank you. Tell us about your birthday. I don't even care who's talking shit about me right now. I feel too, like, I don't know. Wow. Like, I don't know. Happy. Hi, <laughs> Scrape Goat. Sister, I think you missed the ass repair today. Oh, no. Thank you for the super chat. Yeah, I did, actually. The only thing I could think of is she must have just ate and she must have just got high because she's in, like, they tried to bait her with me. She doesn't care. Wow. But again, that's my personal business. Hey, I was yep, doing yep. a lot today. I was out. And I can't, I'm not doing it. Like, I can do it in my heart in public, but. Mm hmm. Mike, remember for three months, happy belated birthday 40th. Thank you, Mike. Ready, set, rabies. <laughs> Thank you. Zoe, I got back to Canada yesterday. Yeah, I'm staying in Canada for good. Wow. We should do a story. <coughs> Boy, I'm still shocked. Do. I don't know why. Um. So yeah, just I came back here like for many reasons. Like there's just I don't even know how to give one answer. Just try, so, try. The marriage is over. Those pillows. You got deported. I You're see. broke. I go back and forth. You know how many times I've made this trip? Like what six? I'll read my chat. Sorry, Bernie. What did I miss? I'm so full of life. Love the sun and rain. Down under shopping bees. Hey, Jazz. Yeah, I'm still married. I'm so relieved when I come back here. Well, you know, while I'm here, yeah, like, there's a relief, but at the same time, there's, like, a heartache a bit, you know? You don't seem like you have heartache. So, yeah. Oh, well, that's life. You don't seem like a woman who just had to leave her beloved husband. I want to be somebody. Pets. I want to be somebody, Billy. Oh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Canada looks good on you. Mimi Pondu. <laughs> Let's go buy a mullet wig. Ready? Please do it. Okay, let's. I'm gonna go drive somewhere to have dinner, and then. Whoa! No, you don't. Oh no, you don't. The stupid thing. Maybe Stella. <laughs> oh gosh, I gotta lose. She's so happy because she probably just got high. Oops. Eight. No, he hasn't been in her chat. Hey, Kathy. Don't you fall. Circle in the sand. Yeah, church of yes, I'm getting Sam. And yes, I'm gonna take very good care of him. His nails are not gonna get too long. Mm-hmm. Chantel's trusty box. Yeah. Poor Sam. He thought he was yeah. free. Yeah, that's true. Some of the abusers are coming back. Her skin is bad. It is. Falls deep. You can dream on. I'd rather be dead. Oh. Can we go egg their house? Yeah, I have a video. Yeah, I filmed some of the journey. Yep. Oh, ghost face is there. We're not over. No. Are you sure about that? Does he know that? Circle in the sand. Thank you, Brittany. Yeah, Sam is coming back. Yeah. My poor guy. I know. That's sad. He was free of you. Wait, somebody said in her chat. We are back because we are free of Salah's iron fist of blocking and it's Chantel's trusty, I don't know, went away. Yeah. There's a tractor coming. Do you think the tractor's sexy? Hi. I don't know, that song always comes to mind. There's a tractor with a, a guy who's carrying a big piece of a tree. Oh. I didn't escape. Someone said wheelchair yes, bees. Let the farting begin, no. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> I have been to Germany. Good to know. Hey, Dara. Yeah. <laughs> Only the German, the uh, Frankfurt airport. I know, Athy. I can't type in the, I can't type in the chat. Are your back problems magically better, too? It's not possible. For my PayPal. Unless someone wants to type it. It's C S A R A C Sarah 084 at hotmail.com or paypal.me slash backslash foodie beauty. 
<clears throat> yeah, Salah and I are fine. I'm, I didn't come here because um, anything to do with the relationship. I uh -huh. came here for it's too hot Kuwait. I need health care. I miss driving. I miss beezing. Okay. And uh, someone asked if you mad. Take a stab at my career in yodeling. No, I'm just joking. In yodeling. <laughs> Julia, yeah, he's going to take care of Julia. While um, you yodel around the world. And he'll just bring her here, you know, or if he, if something happens and he can't, I will go back to Kuwait and get. If somebody doesn't make a foodie beauty yodeling video, I'm going to be so disappointed. And just feel, find out like I'm overwhelmed with bringing, I am not healthy enough. Like, first of all, I can't have my own pet until I get my own place. So right, right then, where would she come right now? You know, second, I'm barely well enough to take myself on this freaking journey. Stupid. Journey. 17 and a half hour freaking travel day. Oh, I legit, like, I can't even tell you. You're so tired. I took a red eye. My flight was at 1.45 a.m. Uh-huh. So, like, it was, like, you're tired already. And then when you start falling asleep, they turn on the lights. It's like, you get, we got to Frankfurt at, like, 6 something in the morning. I was she so does tired. Look, she looks old. Then you have to walk around a huge airport, wait in a huge line for security, and then... Okay, I don't care. I'm going to real time. Sorry. Someone asked, can we get stoned tonight? Leaving him. It's not easy. It's very hard leaving him. It's not easy. Mm -hmm. Chantal, the link is for the people support. They don't want to be attacked for supporting your channel. Oh, I get it. Me personally, I don't care. No, I totally get that. Yeah. Someone said, are you starting your weight loss arc? Please take care of your health for real now that you can. Can we get stoned tonight? When I get my own place, we can have like a, I don't know, hamburgerized bees in. No, <laughs> we can have like, you know, mm -hmm. hang out at night. I can do like live streams like three times a day again. Yay. <laughs> Coffee bees, dinner bees, cooking bees, and night bees. Okay. Mario bees. When are you going to have time to work on your long distance relationship? <sighs> And take care of Sam. No, I'm too nervous driving in Kuwait. I still have the same old CPAP. Someone told her S-Jam has an extra room. No, I'm just kidding. They yeah, said... I'm going to get food, Cassidy. They have healthcare, but it's expensive for, like, certain things. You know? I was attacked and accused of being a troll. People don't know we've been friends for a while. Who said that? Yeah, I heard that. No name. Oh, no name said that? That's not cool. Who attacked no name? Anyways. Anyways. Um, I'm trying to think of what I want to eat. Someone asked her, did you bring your play button home? Where do I want to take you guys? Someone said pizza, weed, Connors, Taco Bell. What are we in the mood for? Pizza and weed, orange Asian, chillip. Indian, not Indian. I don't know. <laughs> the pot pie. Some of the Chinese food. Hey, Brenda, thank you. Lock must. I brought my play button home because I'm gonna have it. I'm gonna send it back. Oh. And they're gonna send me one that says Foodie Beauty, <laughs> because the Miriam one is damaged. Like there was a dent in it. Yeah, I saw that. So they said if it's damaged, I can return it. They will send me a label. I return it. And then once they get it. So Candy, do you think in like two weeks or in another week, she's going to say, oh, she decided to go back because she missed him? They'll send me one back. Someone asked, will you still be rolling down hills on this channel? Much halal stuff here. Amber, get a new one, inshallah. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that. Maybe candy. I might roll down the hill. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Because I'm dressed modest. I can do a modest work hill rolling. Oh, For okay. 10. Yeah. YouTube will not change the name. Farm boy bees. Yum. 
Yum, farm boy. Mac and cheese. <laughs> I know. I thought Foodie Beauty was dead. Well, some parts. Which part? <laughs> but, you know. <sighs> Anyways. Someone asked if her mom's happy that she's home. I'm just trying to be positive. Like, it is hard, you know. When I, like, sometimes I have to really try. Because I do, like... Anyway, I miss a lot of things, you know. Uh huh. Someone said, Who was happy you were home? Her mom or her aunt? Booty's lost in thought. Anyway. Anyway. No, L5, I'm not. <laughs> she never tried, Tom said. Yeah. Who <laughs> was happier I was home? A lot of people. What about your sister? Is she happy? <laughs> what are buffalo balls? I don't want to know. I know, Jerry. Most people have to try to be positive. It doesn't come natural for everybody. Yeah, nothing like the Western world. I don't know. There's a lot of things I miss about the East, too. And there's things I miss even about Thailand. Like, every culture has its pros, you know? Mm-hmm. Someone said, I don't care what you do. Just don't become a potty mouth like you were back in the day. I have loads of, wait, I hate lots of bad language. Someone else asked, when is the hijab coming off? Yes. If, you know, if we were over, I would tell you guys if I felt like it, but stop telling her to eat trash food. If yet. I felt like it. I feel like eating like junk though. No, I'm kidding. Just don't become a potty mouth. I have lots of bad language. No, I'm not going to, Melly. Yeah. You never know though. I don't think I will. Ah, no. Okay. Belinda's big five head said, I'm so happy right now. Okay, go be happy in both places. It's also okay to be unhappy. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, Canada has better gravy. Just breathe and take your time with everything. Yeah, exactly. Can we want it fast? Hi, Jessica. Just put us in your purse when you drive. Dude, that's I want to listen to music and things. Okay. Do they have fork salad in Canada? What? Hi, energy! Strawberry picking bees. Healthy meals only. Belinda's big fun. I'm just kind of shocked. I truly thought she was going to come back in rage today. Like, she's just high in the clouds. Good. I'm so happy right now. Oh, that's mean! <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. Purse bees. Yeah, well, obviously they're going to be higher right now. I was gone for a while. Mm hmm Yeah. All right, let's go for it. Really hard. Really hard. I guess making a future for myself, I need to be healthy, like no matter what. But there it was like a lot harder for me, you know? So I do have a lot more support here. Uh huh. Just want to be, let's drive to Orange Julep and Bees. Are you kidding? I can't go live at Orange Julep. People are going to show up there. They know where that is. But thanks for Who's the super chat. Show up? <laughs> I can get some dog spray. Do you really think? Oh. I don't know. Other than FFG, do you really think people are going to show up? <laughs> it's illegal. What are you even allowed to defend yourself with in Canada? It's illegal to have everything. It's like if someone's trying to kill you and you pepper spray them, you go to jail for the pepper spray and they That's go to jail wild. for murder. But you That's still go wild. to jail for the pepper spray. That's wild. Thanks, Leslie. <laughs> What's Twitter <laughs> saying? Let me go check. So I'll be right back. I just I feel I can't be weird in public there. That's the only thing. <sighs> Thanks, Pam. I'll get some bear spray. <laughs> Carry a butter knife. <laughs> hey, remember that the, the death of a cheerleader? The woman had a knife with her cucumbers in the car. Is that allowed? No. Eva's beauty. I couldn't like use an illegal weapon, though. That's my problem. I can't. I could never. Anyways, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. So far, I see people wondering how long until Foodie exposes um, Scatman. I'm not leaving the Kia. So if you come up to me, I'm just going to drive away. Bright neon screen. Hi, Vanessa. Put put. Oh, and people are making fun of the fact that her glasses are sitting on top of her forehead and not her nose. 
I don't pay the car payments. I know you guys think that, but I don't. So yes, I'll be fine. Do you hear this or is it just me? I don't hear anything. So, um, any other questions before I'm I'm gonna go live again where I get when I get to where I want to eat. Okay. I guess. I have a question. How do you still fit in the Kia? I'll just say I'm on a I'm not going to Akron. Oh, I'm not going to Ohio. I'm not going anywhere where pot is illegal ever again. Hi, Christina. Take your health seriously, please. I don't know. Anyway, sushi? Yeah, exactly. You. I'm just back. Just for a lot of reasons. I'm, just, I'm okay, but. So what is the real reason? Stop saying a lot of reasons. Just tell us. Why are you back? Your life, yeah. Thanks, no name. I'm not planning on going to Kuwait right now, no. Anytime soon. Take us. I'm not going. I'm not doing that travel journey anymore. Like I, I can't do it. Uh huh. So were you kicked like, out? The thousands of dollars spent back and forth. Um. The 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 toll it takes on you mentally. Like every minute, I'm just like, okay, just stay calm, just stay calm. In every lineup, in every, like, oh. Oh, yeah. And remember when she was trying to convince us for a while that that building was like for married couples only and for families? Does Salah have to move then? I know we found out eventually, right? Like single people can live there. But wouldn't that mean he would have to move? It was just a lot of walking. I'm not used to that. Are you serious? And, you know, in Germany airport, you can't ask for help. Like, I, I'm like, is this shuttle? Is there like a shuttle service? Like, they're like, oh, ma'am, you have to pre-book that. It's like for people who are like disabled and you need to book it two days in advance. I was like, okay. <laughs> I'm scared here. I gotta go. Hi, Sabre. Oh, it is Cheryl. How are you? Thanks, Evie's Beauty. I seem happier. I'm sad though. I have a bidet. I took one with me. Salah got me one. <laughs> he thought of that too. See, that's what I miss about him. He thinks of things that I don't think of. Anyway. Sorry, I'm back. I don't know. It is illegal, Hugh. There's things that you'll you don't know and will never understand because I don't talk about it. But uh huh. Yeah. Everything else. They're telling you to make an Amazon yeah, wish list. Thoughtful, you know, in, in a lot of ways. But All right, let's go to real time. There's a groovy Jimmy in the chat. But that's okay. I'm not going to run, keep running back. Like, I have to, like, stick to my guns. Making Amazon. Groovy Jimmy said, kind of hard to keep things private when your entire life is on YouTube for all to see. It's on wishlist for your new place. Thanks for the super chat. Thank you. Thanks, someone, Melly. Someone else said, I hope there's a K Bella 2.0. Same. <laughs> Sorry, my nose. That's not the plan, uh, Mimi Pondu. Hi, Sula. Hope there's not a K Bella 2.0. Me too. Oh. Do you know how hard it is when you've been through something like that with someone to trust them when you're away? So obviously I'm dealing with that. That's crazy. But the thing is, is I'm not going to let it um ruin like my time, you know. And that's really hard for me because that's all I sometimes want to focus on. So I have to force myself to like. Yeah, how are you not worried about the fact that there's nothing that you can do? But, and you know what? Actually, according to you, if you guys are in different countries, it doesn't count as cheating. So he's probably cheating on you like right now and will cheat on you again later. And then again in the morning too. be productive and distract myself with other things and get used to this new reality. And it feels like I'm always getting used to a new reality. And it's like really mentally hard. You know, like I, I make my life harder on myself. You really do, though. You really do. But yeah. 
Dot said that they think that she went straight to Natter's and Dee Dee's and got them groceries. But, um, yeah, so, I mean, you know. She can try to save her leg. True. Yeah. I know, Jenny. I just don't want to talk about it. Uh oh. I just want to focus on positive things. <laughs> Someone in her chat had made a comment saying, let me know when it's time to trash talk Salah. No, if I ever, if something ever happened and I had to be single again, I would stay that way. Would I you? Don't have any emotional energy to invest in something? I just don't. I I can't do it. I don't want to. I don't. So happy with just good people around me. That's platonic. Fine. That's fine with me. So are you preparing us for the breakup? And the PM, look at your we should be. Yep. Just I'm fine. I'm forty. You know. We know, we know. And you look 80. It's wild how that works. Keep, not just age, I don't care. I, I can't keep doing it. My great-grandfather fell in love at 89. Okay, Let's that's go cute. And use the that's really cute. <laughs> just one of these. Okay, I will do that eventually. Yay. I can't yeah, wait. Purple, 100% in us. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I look over See ya! What about the trial? You think maybe that's why she's back? Maybe, Tia. Thank you so much for the super chat. Men need women. We don't need that. Mistress Von Dracula. Yeah, I don't. Paneer and root beer. Paneer and root beer. No name. Keep things private, hun. Whatever will be, will be. You'll be okay. Yeah, thank you, no name. I appreciate that. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I, out of respect for my relationship, because I know you, I want to address just this, that I know a lot of you can't comprehend how I could even, you know, ever forgive somebody, like get forgive him for that or whatever. Mm -hmm. But like I said, I've evaluated on based on a lot of other things, good things in a relationship. And, um, you know, I made that decision. Um, that being said, um, you know, I'm also not going, I'm also taking care of myself and not going to. Like, I'm always, I always have my guard up in a way now, you know, so. Yeah. I also, um, just out of I feel like he cheated again. Respect for my marriage. I don't want to talk about, like, very personal things about our relationship or about Salah. Um, you think so, yeah, Eric? Yeah, Jessica, you guys don't have to. Like, you know, I know a lot of people, uh, bees are still like him and. He is really good to me in a lot of If you were talking to Jessica Mesca, of course she likes Salah. Of course she does. Ways and <laughs> you know, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm not gonna like talk personally about our relationship. I didn't do that really with BB, right? I don't think so. Um, well, maybe a little bit about it's when things are about me and how I'm feeling, it's hard not to talk about that, you know, but Take you your know. time to settle in and just breathe. Thank you, Keena Bear. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. I'm single. That's awesome. Yeah. Maybe, Ash. Thanks, Emma Pearl. Because remember a couple days ago, I don't know, was it four days ago now, when she was doing the rebrand on her channel, at one point in her description, there was no talk of her being married or Salah or anything. And then eventually she added that back in. Maybe. Thanks, Louie, mindfully. Thanks, Don. I'm glad you guys understand. Most OG users do not. <laughs> well. <sighs> Anyways. I hear you, yeah. Freedom. I can't go through. I could never go through that again. No. Is that why you're back These in Canada? These moonlight desires haunt me. They want me. <laughs> okay, that's gonna haunt me, lady. I was listening to that and singing, and I realized I would be on a cringe compilation if anyone saw this. No, Adonis. Yes, let's go. Hey, Ariel. I want to go have dinner. Of course you do. Hi, Melissa. 
Yeah, Grandma G, I am. I'm worlds away from my husband. Yeah, so I'm I'm sad about that. It don't really you know, seem like it, him, but I feel like I had to come back. But then whenever I get here, I'm so sad, and I miss Julia and Harry. You can't ever say goodbye enough, you know. But I hope I see her again someday. That was kind of <laughs> sad. I hope I see her again one day. Aren't you guys supposedly trying to work things out? You're having fajitas? Please, money for a rescue mission. She's fine with Salah for now. He's the cat dad. I feel bad. Whenever you have a pet, you, who? how do you decide who has custody? You know? Like when I, the person, when I moved out from Pete, he kept... The person who actually takes care of the pet. Kept Timbit and I kept the other cats. Like, But this cat we got together and he grew very, very close to her. We both did. We had our like nights every night. She would be laying on the bed. I'd be laying across the bed the other way. And she would lay right at, right by my head at his feet. And we would watch a movie. Because I'm more comfortable when I watch a movie like laying this way. And he's more comfortable this way. Julia's like this. And she watches TV with us. And like she yawns. And she and she, her breast was like fishy moo. Lovely. Thank he's you. He's the best pet dad. Uh, I don't remember the name of the eyeliners from Amazon. I'll check. Yeah. Too, really, though. Danielle? Hi, Abel and Maverick. Hi. <laughs> the pets are fine, Half Light. You're being dramatic for nothing. She's fine. I'm going to get her back. Hopefully. We grow well, through our experiences and experience. If it continues or not, we'll make you grow and stronger. Traveling and getting. Yes. And getting into other cultures, like experiencing other cultures. Yeah. All right. Let's go to real her. time. Putin, oh yeah, Putin. No. Okay, so <laughs> trying to decide what to eat. <laughs> oh, he does, Millie. We we video chat. Yeah, okay, Rook. Well, Sheen Steakhouse, my ass. The commercials for Daniel. Um, yeah, Nia, but not today. I didn't. I haven't really been. I don't know. Like, if I take my meds without the pills, I don't know if I, like. I try fasting, but then, like, sometimes if I take my pills on, like, on an empty stomach, uh -huh. especially the pain ones, the, the NSAIDs or the, like, it just feels, oh, my God, it's the worst stomach pain. So I've learned that, no, if I'm going to take, if I need to take my pills, I have to eat something with it. Someone told so, her stop by the condo for Baba Ganoush. You shouldn't take on an empty stomach. Wings, paneer. <laughs> Someone asked if she's visited Pete. Vietnamese. You're going to have Chinese known him? Yum. Baba gun ew. No way. No, not to that, but yeah, I'm in Canada. So, anyways. Someone asked her to say hi to their kids. They have a new buffalo chicken wrap. Why? Real, oh, yeah, but I'm kind of having trouble not eating. <gasps> chicken parmesan. Okay, I'm gonna go find somewhere and I'll come back. Okay. Go do that. <laughs> Does she not want to show us her location? There's no bathroom around here. I gotta pee. There's no outhouse? Yeah, with the NSAIDs. Yeah, and my diet, like my Janumet, you have to eat with, take with food. So I don't know. People are telling her to go visit Pete. the doctor said. <laughs> Thanks, hearty. I can't have bacon. Chicken parma noodles. Mall Chinese. Oh, mall Chinese. Let's go to the mall. No, not mall. Why not? Get some exercise. To go in a mall right now? Park far away and let's go walk. Hi, Travanda. Be safe and keep positive. Catch you. Thank you, Mrs. Mrs. Carlet. She does look terrible. Mr. Swan Dracula. Amber Chick. What? Oh. Yeah. Someone said, I'm just glad you are back. I'm my best, Bailey. Yes. Shanghai 360. I think they do. Do what the doc says. Yeah. Oh, my God. Shiny object. Hello. Lasagna. Yum. Home dog. I'm making her hungry. There's some halal Indian, Emma, but hibachi. Your teardrop told her, watch your back. You know who might be lurking near you wherever you go. Hibachi. 
Anyway, I'm going to go pick some more and I'll go live again when I'm there, okay? <laughs> yeah, thank you, guys. Bye, foods. I appreciate it. That Jamaican creepy. meat patties, the place is going to close. Rita's, hello. Oh, no. You could get there before it does. Sonic Yellow. Yes, I have planned on getting a doctor. You're excited? Rashetta. Okay, B Mike, I've been seeing them all over in um oops, I didn't mean to do that. I've been seeing them all over like in the in purple glitters chat, like trolling her yeah. and Queen Cobra and stuff like that. But they're in her chat saying, Let me take you to town. Where did it go? Oh yeah, let me take you to town. Yeah, you can get an ulcer, exactly. Watch your back here, drop. Yeah, exactly. You should put a wig on your hijab as a disguise. Hi, Monica. Thank you. Hi, Louise. Thank you, Louise. Thank you, guys, everybody. All right. Never mind if they can cause um kidney issues. Yeah, Lynn. Ulcers. Oh, really, know. Hugh? Mm. Beef and cheddar. <gasps> Peace is working. Ray said, oh, I wonder if M.M. is helping her get a doctor. M.M. offered. Oh, my gosh. Can you imagine if they're friends again? Eat ham as medicine. E Mike also just told her she has nice teeth. Ew. No, thanks. Mac and cheese loaf. That has pork. I wish I had, could have that. It's my favorite deli meat. Arby's got the meats. Oh, I want to go in somewhere and eat. Like, just, you know. Okay, I'll go find somewhere, and I'll come back. Okay. I'll be back, guys, so watch out. Hey, Kara. Okay. Lobster mac and cheese. You know when your thing digs in? Okay, bye. Bye. All right, you guys. So I am going to go take Chachi out and do a few things, and then if I see that she's live, I'll come live again. If you guys want to hang out, if you guys want to hang out again. Um. So as far as her being back and as far as her live streaming, I will catch all the ones that I can. Sometimes we might be late. But I will try to get them. I will try to get them all. <laughs> so excited to see what Twitter is saying. Okay, I think we're going to have to do that later. Or do you guys want me to show you a few? I think I might have like three right now. Hold on. I could show you just a couple. All right, let me share my screen. Also wanting to hang out with Queen Breezy. I'm just excited we get to hang out more. Like I missed going live with you guys so much it's been a nice little vacation it's been nice and quiet but like i miss just getting to chat with you guys because we have like a little friendship going on a little family over here so hopefully you guys could see this yeah okay um now where the heck did i go okay wrong tab all right liz said we're back in canada with new glasses new glasses that are sitting way the f up on your face and squeezing onto your basically huge head to hold on because the ears are down much further on that weird head yeah she looked weird i don't know i guess the filters weren't filtering today jamie said foodie beauty will never go back to kuwait i think that arc is over I also feel like we'll never really know what was happening in the fart box because Salah will not spill. Anything you hear will be second hand. And then they put Allah. Salt and Seth said, there's a lot of you being led down the path again. She's not fixed herself in seven days. And then they said, LOL cycle. It's always part of the cycle. People like this don't change without professional help and within a week. And that's true. Wonder Mom said, Kuwait is done marriage and biggest love story ever is done back to filling the kia with garbage eating crap back to drugs and mental breakdowns back to using pete's and her family until she finds a new natter or gets the old one back back to foodie beauty abusing sam that is so sad to me i feel so bad for sam um salt and sauce said poor julia another pet abandoned she needs to leave sam alone she does need to um Raider's Corner said, mate, she is F-eyed. Yeah, she was high. She was clearly high. Crazy Yo Gabby said, foodie beauty is sending back the Miriam YouTube button and requesting a foodie beauty one. What the F, this spoiled biatch? And Polka Dot Planet said, looks like foodie beauty couldn't stand the heat in that kitchen and got out. She's back in the Kia saddle again. Yeehaw. <laughs> She's animated and giddy. She has plans for poor Sam the cat already, but not for Salah. That will be up to God. Get in, losers. We're going bees in. <laughs> okay, I loved that. 
And Spoonie Nerd asked, how long before Scatman gets exposed again? And it's just a clip of Foodie Beauty, but we just saw her live stream. So when we come back live again, I'll look out for more tweets and I'll retweet them as I see them and we'll cover more of them. Breezy better take it back because I'm not letting down until she tells the truth. I mean, they're not... I. <laughs> I mean, it's not something that, like, I wouldn't wear those glasses and, like, I wouldn't, like, recommend them, but I just felt like she didn't look horrible until I looked closer. <laughs> I, I've seen her look worse. I've seen her look absolutely worse. So uh, she didn't look horrible to me. But the more I look at them, I see they keep going further and further up her forehead. <laughs> and I thought she looked cleanish today until I focused on her skin and I realized that that face hasn't been washed in God knows how long. Okay? Okay. I'm wrong sometimes. <laughs> round face and round glasses. I mean, she looks like a blueberry to me. Like a studying blueberry. A librarian blueberry. I don't know. She looks like a blueberry. That's what I do know. All right. I'll see you guys when she comes back. Okay? I'm going to go do a few things. So look for me when she comes live. Thank you so much, you guys, for the super chats. Thank you so much to all the members and the mods. And I will see you, I'm sure, in just a few minutes. Bye, you guys.